And this is what we call the establishing shot. I think we're supposed to be in Van Nuys by noon. My father was an attorney. Sorry, is. My mother died last year, 2010, in a car accident. My Aunt Katie has been raising, has been... Madison is living with me now. And apparently my dead father will be living with us too now. He's not dead. I was one of the people working with the Live and Let Die organization. I mean, we didn't know. We, we thought we were letting them rest in peace. I and mean, now since they've started... Um, we're unfreezing them. Bringing them back. I mean, don't know you. You hear stories about them being somewhere else. He wanted to be frozen until they could find a cure. They brought him back too soon. You don't even know if he's going to be normal. The revivals. That's what they're calling us because we were revived. <laughs> I used to remember growing up in the South, a revival was something held under a tent, saving people's souls. <laughs> I guess I'm one of the lucky ones. I remember everything, but I, I can't describe it. That's what people always ask about. What was it like? What was heaven like? I can't describe it. It's like being here and everywhere, connected to everything. You are everything. You feel everything. You see everything. You touch everything. You smell everything. You, you taste everything. But those senses, what we know them to be, it's indescribable. Does that make any sense? Well, so you were happy. <laughs> it's indescribable. Am I getting paid for this? Uh, it's just part of the documentary. No, I mean to take him. I, uh, no, I'm sorry. White balance, please. Figures. Government just expects us to take these people. You know, it's not our fault that Cryogen bottomed out and, you know, went out of business, and it's not our fault that they lost all their insurance. I don't even know him. Testing, can you hear me? Yep. Do you like what you hear? Ooh, I like everything that's coming out of your mouth. <laughs> You're such a tease. Poor. I don't understand why I have to be the one to take him. I can barely afford to take care of myself. Uh, they're here. Are you ready for this? My mom used to talk about him. She said he was a son of a bitch. And what were your mother's memories of him? Um, that he used to beat her. Well, spanked. That's what they called it then, spanking. Of course, she parked her car in the garage for the last time. Jesus, he doesn't look that much older than me. Why is he tied up? SOP. What? Standard operating procedure. Why didn't procedure? you just say that? Hi, I'm Ariel DeMay. I'm Mr. Hills' transitionary counselor. You. Am I safe with him? He's a stage two. What does that mean? Because of the length of time he was in suspended animation, there was substantial brain damage. Awesome. Wait, can he clean himself? I'm sorry? Like, if he shits himself, am I gonna have to clean him up? He's he looks a, like a vegetable. He's a stage two. Stop saying that! Speak English, bitch! There was substantial brain damage. Awesome. Do you own a gun? No. Why? You don't own a gun. No. Why? You should own a gun. You. You. Do. I Camera's rolling? I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. Just tell us how you're feeling. I mean, I don't know what I'm supposed to do with him. I don't know him. It's like, surprise, here's your dead grandpa. And what's he saying? <laughs> what was that? I'm sorry? Over there, what was that? I saw something. Is everything okay? No! You didn't see that? What? It was like a thing. Uh, thing? Like a person. I'm not crazy. But he said you were crazy. What's he doing? Oh what is he doing? Follow him. What's he doing? Follow him. Is he getting in? Well, should we Wait, jump in? He's gonna drown. You just are those things and more. And when I say more, I'm talking about things that you and I couldn't even begin to express. And, and, and even when I say I, I can't even begin to touch the magnitude because this, this is just the smallest molecule of like, it's like, it's like water. Like we're, we're a drop of, we're a millionth of a drop of water in the entire ocean. And yet we are everything. Did you see mom there? Seriously, just let him die. Oh, shit! 
sound problems. I, I'm getting that too. It's like a it's like a gurgling. <laughs> oh my god. Dude, help me. Call an ambulance. I, oh. She's bleeding from the mouth. Oh. Oh. Hurry! I, I need an ambulance at 8141 Advantage Place. What the hell is that? It's right there in the window. Look at that. Oh my god. Oh my god. Hurry up. Oh Jesus. Oh my god! We are all connected. You, me, good, light. There is no beginning and there is no end. Really, who are we to play God? Who are we to bring these people back if they're even coming back at all? I mean, I don't know. Maybe they were in heaven, but what if they weren't? We're all connected. We're all connected. That's all we hear from them, the revivals. We're all connected, so what now? <laughs>